Cardiovascular disease equally affects women and men and the cardiovascular disease causes about one out of three deaths in both women and men. So it's really a misconception that cardiovascular disease is a man's disease. However, women develop cardiovascular disease typically a little bit later in their life as compared with men. And once they develop it, it's more often as stroke bears in men, it typically presents as a cardiac event. But as women live longer than men, uh, they ultimately catch up with men and the number of deaths of cardiovascular disease in women actually is bigger than that in men. The presentation of, of cardiovascular disease is different between the sexes, as I said, but at the same time the symptoms of heart disease are very similar between the sexes. Chest pain, weird feeling in the, in, in the left arm are equally seen in both women and men. Women, however, also can experience other symptoms of heart disease that are not often recognized timely, and that causes, of course, delay in diagnosis and uh, worse prognosis as a consequence. But women, like men, should be equally aware of their risk of heart disease. And so the risk factors for, for cardiovascular disease are very similar between the sexes and include modifiable risk factors such as smoking, diabetes, high blood pressure, lipids, overweight and obesity. And whilst these factors are associated with the risk of heart disease in both women and men, we know that some risk factors actually pose women at a greater excess risk as compared with men. So for example, as compared with the women without diabetes, having diabetes poses women at a greater excess risk of heart disease as compared with men. So women with diabetes, but also women who smoke, should be additional, should be extra aware of their risk of heart disease. Yes, yeah, so with respect to women, on top of those uh, risk factors that affect both women and men also are exposed to uh, a couple of sex-specific risk factors. So an early menarche, so er early puberty, but also early menopause are associated with a greater excess risk of cardiovascular disease in women. Uh, and also factors around pregnancy, such as uh, repeated miscarriages, are associated with a greater risk of, uh, of heart disease, as are preeclampsia, so hypertension in pregnancy, and diabetes in pregnancy. So again, all risk factors that help to identify high-risk women at an early stage in life.